All right, who's next in the NAB Awards category, Mr. Verge? Black Magic Cinema Camera. Of course, we've got to talk about this. This is the Most K for Your Buck Award. Why? Well, it's not a 4K camera, but it is a 2.5K camera. A little bit more than halfway there. Most K for Your Buck because how many bucks does it cost? What, $29.95. So almost as many dollars as Ks. 2.5K for $29.95, $3,000. That's pretty awesome. Blackmagic says this camera is shipping in July. All right, it records 2.5K raw in a 12-bit sort of a Bayer format directly to solid state drives inside the camera. What if you don't want to do 2.5K? What if you're you know, not interested in doing all that color correction in post? No problem. It also records Aja's, uh, Apple's ProRes codec and Avid's DNX HD codec. So those will be 10-bit codecs versus the 12-bit raw 2.5K codec that you can record. Um, all three of them can be recorded on the SSD. It also has HD-SDI output in case you want to record to some 10-bit recorder like a Sound Devices PIX240 or the nice 260 you saw in our NAB wrap-up video. Additionally, it's got a touchscreen interface. So it's, um, it's a five inch viewfinder so you can see what you're shooting. That also acts as a touchscreen interface so you can enter some metadata. Metadata entry is a big deal and that's, that's gonna show up a little bit later in these awards that we're handing out in NAB. Um, additionally, for the $29.95, uh, in going with our most K for your buck theme, DaVinci Resolve and Ultrascope software are included in the package. So you used to be spending two grand on software, now you're spending zero dollars on software. You spend $29.95 on the camera, it's two and a half K, it's got the EF and the ZE lens mount, so you could use your Fuji and your Canon lenses right on this camera, uh, and DaVinci and Ultrascope are bundled right in there. What about audio? 48 kilohertz, 24-bit audio coming in off a pair of quarter-inch jacks. Not XLR, but you know, for $3,000, what do you really expect, right? 13 stops, 13 stops of dynamic range. The viewfinder does show peaking, so you can have your, your, your colored peaking. It's got a five megabyte per frame recording data rate when you're shooting that 2.5K RAW. What does that mean? Well, if you're shooting in 24P, you can fit roughly 30 minutes on a 250 gig SSD drive. What if you're not shooting in 24P? Other options include 2997, 30P, and alert Alan Tepper, this camera comes built in with 25P frame rates, one of Alan's favorites. Check him out on technotour.com, always promoting the world cam ready cameras. Uh, our friends here in Miami often have to deal with South American and European PAL frame rates, so we're very happy that the Blackmagic Cinema camera does include the 25P frame rate.